Aisha, we're going to kick things off in Gwinnett County with a deadly van crash. The driver of that van has now been charged with vehicular homicide. Six people were killed and 10 others hurt when the van rolled on Interstate 85 over the weekend. Investigators believe the driver made a reckless lane change. Georgia is now getting some federal help to get rid of lead in drinking water pipes. The U.S. Senate voted overwhelmingly to pass the act with Senator John Ossoff helping to secure the vote. Because our kids are drinking water, but in some cases comes through lead pipes, hundreds of faucets in Georgia schools that could be delivering unsafe water. There's so much more work like that that needs to be done. Georgia State Board of Education is in the process of testing 800 schools for lead in the drinking water. Preliminary estimates show high levels of lead in hundreds of school faucets. Today, President Joe Biden started his visit to Georgia in planes. He and the First Lady met with President Jimmy and Rosalind Carter. The four are old friends. In Biden's first year as U.S. Senator, he was an early supporter when then Georgia Governor Carter ran for the White House. Plains residents say it's the first time a sitting president has visited Plains since Jimmy Carter left the White House 40 years ago. And tonight, the